Hi guys, welcome to Resource News. Busola Dakolo revealed how the senior pastor of Commonwealth of Zion Assembly, Pastor Biodun Fatorimbo, raped her twice two years ago. In an interview with Wineninja, Busola gave an account of how she met the pastor while she was in secondary school and started worshipping at his den club, Turn Church, after a lot of persuasions from her sisters. She revealed in details how Pastor Biodun Fatoimbo was ruthless and unremorseful during the period he raped her. She later went to reveal how she finally opened up to her family about the rape incident and how her brother was held back from attacking Pastor Fatoimbo. Let's watch the video. That was how he, he found difficulty to enter, but he just kept, I was like grunting, I would cry, I would, I was just doing a whole lot of mixed feelings and all that, and then um, he eventually penetrated, even blood dropped on the floor. Let's see what Nigerians have to say about this. Simeon Wayland said, if all our allegations are true, then I'm speechless. This is one of the reasons I stopped attending Pentecostal churches. Shegun Oloja said, Man of God, ke, talo ni fadawere. Stay strong, Busola, we love you. Spicy Eta said, Why didn't you tell this story in the days of Christ, when he was not so popular and when you were not Timmy Dakolo's wife? I'm sorry, but this doesn't add up. B. Kodje Beauty said, I am not a fan of a lot of pastors, and this pastor happens to be among them. But on this note, why did she not shout, struggle, fight back, or just do something? Slap the man when he was not holding a gun and a knife. Amatola Jalade Ekeinde is one of the proudest moms on earth at the moment, as her daughter, Maria Ekeinde, backs two degrees at the age of 19. The excited movie star and mom took to her Instagram page on Wednesday, June 26, 2019, where she shared photos and videos from her daughter's graduation ceremony. Even though her husband and herself did not attend the graduation ceremony, she thanked her son who represented them and the friends who showed up to celebrate with their daughter. Let's see what you guys have to say. Dotun said, this your son's swag though is 100%. Uh-uh, congrats mom and daughter. God's blessings. Raymond Oyekwere said, see person picking and wife, you too find Joe. M. Butilio said, Congratulations to her. You and her hubby, well done. I tap this grace for my daughter. Ijama Maureen Chima said, Congrats, sweetie. This is just the beginning of good things. Over 200,000 Nigerians fight for 10,000 constable robes. Earlier today, the Police Service Commission announced that a total of 210,150 applicants will be screened for the 10,000 constable robes available for the recruitment into the Nigerian police force. Let's see what Nigerians have to say about this. Only one guard said, please, they have to undergo psychiatric training too. Mopasa underscore said, Nigeria, my country, which way? So far, no, they tire on her. Zenith underscore ST said, if you can't beat them, join them. Trust me, that won't stop the brutality. That's it, guys. Don't forget to catch us on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And check out our other interesting content. And make sure you subscribe, like, share, and also click on the notification bell for instant notifications. Bye, guys.